Okay, I'm back. I'm about, I wasn't expecting this to be three videos, but oh well. I'm about three RPGs away from having <clears throat> every RPG from the sixth generation. That would be a feat for me. It may not mean much to anyone else or to, to many people. It means a lot to me because the sixth generation is my favorite generation of gaming. As you guys know, it was an excellent time for games, in my opinion. I really enjoyed everything. I think they nailed it. They nailed the movie-based games. Some of them were flops. A lot of them were good. They nailed the anime-based games. Some of them were flops. Some of them were good. They nailed, you know, just the regular RPGs made by developers. Said maybe don't do anime or any other type of media. I think they did pretty good. I think, you know, Sony and Microsoft and GameCube had some really good games in terms of shooters, RPGs, <coughs> and adventure games. Let's see. <coughs> Excuse me. I would already have all of the uh, the, uh, the RPGs for the 6th generation. But, I let a friend of mine, an ex-friend of mine, uh, borrow some games. While she was borrowing them, we decided to terminate our friendship. And so I didn't want nothing to do with her, so I was like, screw it. Keep whatever I gave you, I don't even want to see you. Whatever. And I'm a, I'm a pretty nice guy. <laughs> you gotta really pee me off for me to be like that. And, uh, <clears throat> so it's not every single RPG for the sixth generation, but my words exactly is that it's every RPG that matters. What do I mean by that? Well, there are plenty of RPGs. Well, a few RPGs from the PS2. <clears throat> well, two that I, two that I found for the PS2 and the original Xbox that they're not really worth getting. One of them is Fantasy Star for the original Xbox. That is an online only game. I didn't know that until I bought it. Well, and that's rare for me because I normally do all of, I, I, do, I normally do a lot of research. I read all the reviews. Maybe I missed the part where they said it's online only. So I bought the game and I was unable to play it. Uh, the next game would have been, uh, excuse me, there's a Final Fantasy game, I think Final Fantasy XI for the PS2, that's uh, online only. <coughs> so that's another game right there. And that's it. Th that, that's what I mean by all the RPGs that matter. I think I have every RPG, just about. The only one I'm missing, the only, one, the only ones that I'm missing would be Evolution World which is for the GameCube which is the one I let my ex-friend borrow, <coughs> which I'll be buying back next month. <coughs> and I'm missing a game called Shattered Union for the original Xbox. It is a strategy RPG. It's a, uh, like, it's a Marine-based game. Like, you, you play as, like, I guess the U.S. Marines or whatever. But it's, uh, like, top-down view, sort of like what you'd see in a... <coughs> kind of what you see in like uh I don't want to say advanced wars but uh something like this right here I should do a rare RPG video one day I think I've already done it done one but I'll, I'll probably do another one if you can see these little things right here see the little figures it's kind of like that I'll probably do a gameplay video of this one day but yeah uh Shattered Union and evolution worlds and then I think that I will be finished and then after that I'll probably just do some r more rare RPG hunting although I have all the rare RPGs I want to get seconds like uh, MS Saga is a very a very uh, expensive game here is a uh, here is some more pickups right here Finally got Budokai. I'm not really a big uh, fighting game person, but I do like fighting games. You know, I, I, I've been playing Street Fighter and Mortal Kombat all my life, so I don't want to buy those games and add them to my collection. Except for Mortal Kombat Trilogy, which I already have. I figured, you know, I, I do want a fighting game collection, and I I will build a, build up my collection, but it'll be of games 
that I never played before, or games that I always wanted to play. I have a few. I have uh, Arcana Hearts, which is a good game. I have the Samurai Showdown Anthology. Samurai Showdown is like one of my favorite fighting games, even though I suck at it. <laughs> but yeah, these two right here. I'm going to buy the rest of the Dragon Ball Z games. I just decided to get this first because this game is the most expensive one. This is not a fighting game. <clears throat> I just wanted to have it because I wanted to have all of the uh, the strategy simulation games or whatever for the uh, PS2. And also, you know, it looks like a pretty interesting game. And yes, I do have to go match with the Canon games, all five. <clears throat> I've been unable to get a proper copy of Duelist of the Roses. They both have the booklets. It's just I need something that's in good shape. But these are all games that I plan on buying seconds of, or or better copies of. <coughs> One of my gems. I may do a let's play of a mobile suit game, but uh, Gundam versus Zeta Gundam. Zeta Gundam. This is nice. Very nice. I have two copies of that.